welcome back to another video from Somos Biology. This video is going to be very very important for your CSI and life science preparation because here in this video I am going to share a secret strategy that I share with only my paid students but this time this is for free because I have made a different strategy for them now. So now this strategy worked for us like a charm and this strategy will help you to revise your CSI and syllabus maximizing uh, the importance of the topics and maximizing your score capabilities. So how to revise CSI net syllabus which is a huge syllabus and what you should require to prepare them and where do you get all the revision strategies, where to get the resources, I am going to tell you everything regarding this revision. So, so if, if you are a CSI net aspirant and want to revise CSI net syllabus in a short span of time, you cannot afford to skip this video. So let's start with this idea, a simple 10 by 10 strategy. The strategy is known as 10 by 10 strategy okay now first things first before talking about the strategy i must tell you one thing that how do we develop this strategy revision we are talking about revision we are not talking about reading new things and getting new concepts in our brain so to understand this there are two segments to your preparation two segments remember that segment number one here and this is segment number two the segment number one is new knowledge new knowledge okay and segment number two is a, a revision okay revision there are two separate segments now the new knowledge segment is uh, the segment the starting of your preparation okay and the revision is the ending of your preparation for any competitive exam this stands true if you are preparing for any competitive exam this will stand true so, so, we have this starting of the preparation, this is where you understand new things. So, before that you know which units you are going to prepare. Whether you are preparing all 13 units or you are preparing 10 units or you are preparing 8 units or you are preparing 6 units according to your requirement. Now, here the 6 unit preparation is not recommended at least 8, 10 or 13 units. So, once you decide which number of units you prepare, you already know your time frame. And what do you mean by time frame? So, for 13 units you need at least 1 year, for 10 units again 6 months to 1 year, for 8 units also uh, 6 months let's say, okay. So, this is the time frame that you are taking for preparation. There are people who ask for preparation in th 3 months and 1 month, I don't teach them, I tell them just you can go anywhere else who is uh, telling you to prepare in 1 or 3 months, go there. But this is the time, 6 month, 1 year preparation time frame, okay. And in this time frame, if your time frame is 6 month then you should uh, take last one and a half month for your uh, revision and if your preparation is one a year time frame then last three months will be accounted for your revision okay this state is clear so once that is clear you understand what is revision why revision is so important I will now move to the next part. Why revision is so important is because you know while you are learning new topic, this is the first thing, you are learning new topic, okay. So you are reading uh, biochemistry, you are uh, getting idea about metabolism, the different metabolic pathways, how they are related, their regulation, everything you learn. You are preparing uh, plant physiology, you are reading from photosynthesis, C3, C4 camp plant differences. So you learned all these things. But during the time of new knowledge gaining phase, you need to find a way to keep important informations written in your notebook either you can write it on your own while you're reading from my videos or from any other videos or any other video resources or any other book resources but you need to point out important things if you're reading from book line it and take a note on this because you know there are notes available but the note available is written by somebody else from their point of view while you're reading the topic means let me say for example uh, you have very hard time understanding the metabolism part. So, the note that you will prepare from there will be huge. But let's say you understand uh, non-Mendelian genetics, non-Mendelian inheritance very well. So, you don't need to take much note on there. So, based on that customized note must be prepared by you only. That's why I always tell one year preparation time frame is the best. Even one and a half year, two year, even is better. If you are preparing for CSI from your MSc days, you can do that. And during that time, you have more than two, sometimes two years, more than two years in your hand to prepare for it. So that is even better. So what we need to do, you need to write down important information. So this is the first resource that you need. So the resources, let me write uh, resources 
uh, that you need for this revision is that uh, customized customized notebook not the ready made notebook customized notebook now if you are lazy enough and you think you cannot make this and you have less time let's say 6 month 5 month 4 month their customized notebook won't help you in that case you can get or store brought okay store bought no notebook store bought notebook we also provide shomus bhai ji uh, blueprint of life science book is already there right but again i am telling you your own prepared notebook would work and comes more handy than store book notebook okay so this is something that you need the second thing that you need are uh, this this note it's a special tools to remember information to put information in your brain and revise them faster so like tables charts mind maps okay mnemonics you need all this and no one in youtube except me help providing all this to the students because i personally prepared from all this while i was preparing csi net like more than i think 14 15 years ago so this is something that you need to prepare from tables charts mind maps mnemonics this is something you need so this tables charts mind maps mnemonics these things they will put information in your brain faster and will stay with you for longer that's why they are important and you know if you follow shomus biology we are uploading videos on mnemonics we have plenty of mnemonics and we are making more mnemonics for csi net in years to come we have started the mind map series we'll have 360 mind map for 360 days of preparation and today at the end of this lecture i'll be providing you the table section as well you can get our new tables for most important topic of csi net syllabus that we provide to your online coaching candidates i'll tell you how to get that so this is something required for your preparation and the third resource that you need for preparation are previous years questions pyqs if possible sorted by unit if not then only the previous years question if possible with explanations we at shomus biology also provide that net set go book with previous year's question papers with answer with written explanations you might need that if not explanation then only the previous year's questions sorted by unit would be good better but no if if it's if they are not sorted by units but still the questions it's fine okay you can get this pyqs you need these three resources so you have your plan at the beginning you learned all the things because in the revision we are not talking about new topic we are talking about existing topic discussion and in the revision i'll be talking about how to practice because you have all this notebook written in your customized notebook you have everything written in this customized notebook of yours and you have your tables mind maps mnemonics everything handy so you have so much information written but they're written in a small compact format because remember in a table so much information can be written like four or five pages written in a small table of half page that is what is needed while revising if you see paragraphs after paragraphs you will not feel like reading them while revising but from a table you can easily connect them see the normal book and the comic books people love to read from comic books because there are small piece of writings and more graphics so graphics always help in life sciences in biological sciences medical sciences graphic helps a lot okay so you have these resources ready you keep them handy once you have them handy now we apply the 10 by 10 strategy of our preparation now this strategy will help you prepare part c as well as part b because they are filled this tables this mind maps are filled with information they are good for part b and they are also good for part c because you already have the information while you studied and now you kept the information in your notebook so while revising you understand what makes uh the like what is the mechanism behind the process for example let's say dna replication transcription translation all, all these mechanism based techniques are very well understood there 
So what you need to do now is that the PYQs 10 years, last 10 years PYQs, right? Now let's imagine uh, last 10 years means there are like 10 every year 2 nets, so there are 20 net examinations and from 20 net examinations, uh, let's imagine that for every single unit approximately 5 questions in part C, 5 questions, uh, so approximately 5 questions in part C and approximately 3 questions in part B if we consider, okay. Uh, three four questions in part B. So what we can get is that approximately so for part C we get hundred hundred questions hundred part C question for every single unit unit one two three four like all the thirteen units you have hundred part C questions and approximately you have eighty part B questions. Okay. So now what you need to do is basically divide this part C questions into ten sections ten part C question ten rounds. And for part B, 10 part B questions, 8 rounds. So this is called the 10 by 10 strategy because you have 10 part C question of unit 2. Such 10 rounds are there. So now you revise. How do you revise? You start taking the round 1. Round 1, answer all the questions without looking at the answer explanation. Just look at the question, try to solve them. Solve them with time check the time right time is important and then <clears throat> check the score if you get more than 65 percent you consider that topic done and if your score is less than 65 percent then you take round two okay but before going into round two you go back to your resources that is table charts mind maps and your customized notes Revise again. So another two hours revision. Once the revision is over, at night again open round two. Check your score. Let's say this time 60%. Even dropped. No good. Again get back to table charts, customized textbook again. Try to revise. And particularly revise the topics where you failed in your question paper. So you need to also analyze the question answers. If you choose option B, it was wrong. So option A was correct. Why option A was correct? Why? B is not correct. You need to find that too. I need to go get back to that topic from your book and resources and study that. So if a topic is totally unclear, get back, try to find a video resource of mine or any other video. You can watch that and get back. Okay. Then again, next day, operate on round 3. This time you get 67%. Good. So you get a good score, 67% good enough and uh, so you try so you don't revise again again go with second uh, round four you get 70 percent so you are constantly getting better score so once you get constant better scores in three consecutive rounds okay then you can decide okay fine my preparation is approximately well enough in that topic so you can leave that topic that particular unit is done that particular unit is prepared now you can move on to the next unit okay this strategy should continue feels difficult right but think of the idea once you get this point this is not that difficult it might seem difficult now because you haven't started anything yet this is the most important thing to qualify any exam is to understand the exam the mindset to qualify and conquer this exam is more important no exam in your life is better than bigger than your life bigger than your mindset you can win anything if you decide to win right that is the most important thing the mindset is most important thing so if you want uh, like if you ask me like how do you prepare like this is a strategy so if you are asking for a strategy i give you a strategy but there are people who can't even follow don't even follow any strategy can still qualify so there is a difference of the preparation idea but i believe if you want to practice something religiously you want a system to incorporate so that you can follow that system to reach the success this is a system that I found really, really helpful while preparing for CSN examination. You follow this system for the last two months because you have two months left now for the CSN preparation in the upcoming times, two months or one month. This time is very crucial for your revision. And like I told you before, like the revision is the time where you should not read new topics. New topic time or new topic reading time is over. Now this is a time where you should revise the topic. And once you get this revision process done like this process, because you are answering only 10 questions at a time. 
but PYQs are most important and the resources are very important okay so utilize this and you will definitely get a better score and a chance to win at CSA net examination now let me give you another idea regarding so so the stable part right I told you like you can get this mind map book which is available in Amazon for as uh, low as 400 or something like that approximately that that is the amount near 500 rupees low, less than 500 rupees mind map book is available separately if you want to get our table part only on online catching uh, coaching candidates get the tables but if you want the table we also are offering an, a, a pdf version of that table and that is also 500 rupees you want if you want the tables the most important topics they are represented in a tabular format for your CSA net preparation you can get that this is the amount 500 that you need to pay we will add you uh, to, the, to utilize this table but this is non printable and this is only to be understood with a electronic view mode only so keep this in your mind if you want to get it how to get it I will tell that at the end I will attach that part of the video at the end of this video so so I will show you exactly uh, what this table are and this is our batch and inside the batch we have this tables so particularly uh, the content section inside the content we have the tables uploaded study material section recently uploaded this table section. table ppt and this is the powerpoint that we are talking about this is the table ppt which will be very handy for all of you you can clearly see all the tables are listed summarization of the bonds nucleic acids and everything uh, this table is provided for all the different uh, units it's there i think how many pages are there uh, it's 188 pages Hardy Weinberg and all the different units so 1 to 13 all the tables uh, are there 1 to 11 actually not 12 13 is not there yet but uh, unit 1 to unit uh, 11 uh, is written here in this table and actually in our online coaching we explain all the table uh, during the classes so as a summary once we cover a topic a topic is over uh, then we explain uh, the summary of that topic with the help of the table so my explanation is always with uh, these tables but here except for this explanation you'll get the tables as a soft copy and you can get it uh, as uh, much as 500 rupees and we'll deliver this table to you and you can practice uh, i mean revise from this table as a resource so Apart from that, you can prepare your own table, you can prepare your own mind map, but mnemonic videos are for free in YouTube available, you can get them and you can make your own notebook which will definitely help you in this preparation process. So I believe this 10 by 10 strategy will definitely help you to qualify CS and life science examination. All the very best for the exam and uh, if you like this video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends and subscribe to get more videos like that in future. Thank you. Bye.